Welcome to your first day as a trainee driver here on ScotRail's Fife Circle Line. Edinburgh Waverley is the second busiest station in Scotland after Glasgow Central. The station serves as the northern terminus of the East Coast Main Line, taking passengers to and from London King's Cross. There is a missing route map over there. Fix that while you're here. Head of Driver and Passenger Experience, Angus Stewart, would like to speak to you. Follow the markers to board the train before departure. decided to link the inner and outer loop services together by reopening the eastern end of the old Edinburgh and Northern Railway to Fermland branch to passenger traffic. With these two lines in operation, this created a loop in the county of Fife, joining at Inverkeething station and Glenrothes the Thornton station. This created the name of the line, the Fife Circle. Located on the route is the Fourth Bridge. First opened in 1890, the structure spans 2,467 metres and stands 137 metres tall above its foundations. Two hundred trains use the bridge every day, carrying three million passengers per year, and it weighs a whopping 53,000 tonnes. Back in June 2022, Scottish Power Lines began work to electrify 65 miles of Fife Circle track between Haymarket and Dalmeny for use by electric multiple units. Further phases are planned to electrify the lines between Kinghorn, Thornton, Ladybank and Loch Gelly. This train is a BR Class 170 diesel multiple unit in ScotRail livery. They were first introduced into service in 1999, shortly after the privatisation of British Rail. As a trainee driver on this route, you will drive this train across the Fife Circle. Take on the busy commuter services and stunning scenery in true ScotRail fashion. Take in all that the Fife Circle Line has to offer. Hello and welcome to the Training Centre. In this training module, you will be learning how to drive a Class 170 in ScotRail livery. You can now enter the cab to get started.
insert and switch the master key to the unlocked position. Set the train's headlights to day running. Headlights are important for letting others know that this train is currently operational. The reverser controls the direction the train will drive in. If it is in any other position other than off, then the cab is considered active. Set this to forward now. The door power button is mainly used by conductors to control the passenger doors while inside the cab. Press the door power button to allow in-cab control of the passenger doors. Press the door release buttons to open the passenger doors. Press the door close button to close the passenger doors. Let's get moving. Set the throttle brake to the P1 position. Slowly notch up the throttle brake lever to reach the speed indicated. Let's prepare the train to slow down. Use the braking zone on the throttle brake lever to come to a stop at the indicated area. Don't worry if you miss the station. You are free to go around this loop as many times as you want.
let's shut down the cab. Now you are ready to drive the Class 170 on the Fife Circle. <laughs> 